hello all in this video we will try to create shots from using normal videos okay there are various scenarios why you would like to use a high-end cameras right because of better quality because number of color combinations pixels clarity on zoom etc i would not say smartphones are not a best option but you have better advantage using high-end cameras people will try to tend uh, to create lots of shots because it gains much faster popularity compared to normal videos the problem arises when we use shots right uh, we don't know by default it doesn't fit into short resolutions which uh, platform support like TikTok, Insta, YouTube all those stuff right we have to do some changes so that it should fit and the problem comes is like how we will edit those into supporting short resolution so in this video we'll try to learn how we can easily convert the normal videos into shorts uh, using free open source software and uh, Blender video editing workspace so let's begin before we start uh, working on converting a normal video into short right so what we'll try to do is it we'll learn different types of resolutions which are available so so when you take normal videos right and uh, with higher end resolutions cameras right so by default it will be having different resolution which are not compatible with short platform like for youtube insta tiktok all those stuff so it will be short in landscape full landscape or horizontal so if you see it 16 into 9 by default it will be there in that right? but the default there are lots of platforms which support shorts right there are those are different resolutions so if i see right the news feed which will be coming in one is to two the square resolution is one is to one and we have vertical resolutions which are four is to five so the four is to five resolutions are basically suitable for facebook and instagram reels and then there is a two is to three which which has some gaps in in top and bottom uh, here if you see right four is to five will have more gaps compared to this one so if you want if you don't want any gap on top or bottom right so you have to convert that entire video which was shot in your camera right into 9 is to 16 resolution which will be nothing but full vertical or full portrait so this we'll try to learn so I'll, I'll show you how to do this without using any paid software uh, and I'm using open source software which is called as blender so we'll try to convert without spending more time and and try to easily learn how to convert a normal video into a short compatible video so let's jump in so i have opened blender video editing workspace so so once you open it right you, you can go i have lots of videos to how to come to this page uh, i don't want to go into in a deep uh, so you can just refer my old videos if you want so i'll just import a sample video this is the sample video which will be working so i'll just import it here so once i import it right i'll just adjust it i'm adjusting and i'm zooming out so that it just fits in single frame so now it this looks good so once you import it by default blender is only eight second video so if you see that end frame is 250 so you have to change it so the total entire length of this video is in frames 1803 so i'll, I'll just right click and then set that preview range to strip then I have to change it here as well in rendering rate it should not have any issues i'm changing i've changed the both settings so this is the video i'll just play it and show you what is the video It's just a normal video okay which is shot in high end resolution mode camera devices so i'll convert this into 9 is to 16. so by default right when you you, you click on this video clip and then so once you click on this right output properties so this will come up by default right the resolution for x axis it will be 1920 pixel and y axis it will be 1080 so for mobile compatible resolutions right so what you have to use is so for converting 9 is to 16 9 is to 16 right so the resolution you have to set is for x-axis 1080 pixel and y-axis is 1920 so let's just convert that i'll change it i'll go here and 1080 pixel y-axis i'll set it as 1920 pixel once it is done right so if you see right by default it sets this frame and you will see the right side and left side go off some of the content so that's how it works. so you can fit the entire frame into this but uh, it doesn't it will have a lot of gaps here so let's just not do it so by default right you can just do this stuff so it will just fit in mobile compatible frame so once it is done right you have to what you have to do is you have to go to transform and then you can change the locations based on that so i'll click on here x-axis and then if you want right just right click it will just extend that so we don't want this so i'll just try to zoom in and try to fit entire frame if required so i can do this stuff so in this case right what will happen it will be having a compact but you know it will have a lots of space here and down so suppose if you don't want this space to be added so then what you can do is right you can just increase so have x-axis scale and then i'll what i'll do is i'll do it in y-axis now this is how you can fit entire stuff without losing any content of your video so let's just play it quickly
So this is how it looks. In this case, right, what has happened, right? 16 inch to 9 is entirely compact into this 9 without losing any frame of a video. We have fit it into 9 inch to 16. In this, right, what will happen? The entire stuff will be clubbed in the sense, so it will not look that much properly. You can use that also, but if you suppose I don't want, I want to have some not compactness. I want to have uh, even if it is fine, if I lose some content of the video, right? Then what you can do is, right, you can just extend this part. What I will do is, right, I'll just try to. Then you have to come to this X axis position and then just make it and change also the, the position. So if I do it long, right, it will just go off like this. Okay, if I want to change right side, left side, you can do it. So what I will do, I'm setting it to zero rough now so that it fits in frame. And then what I will do is, right, I'll just change this stuff somewhat bit. Even if it I lose some content, it should be fine. This looks good to me. And then if you want right position, you can just change left, right side. If you want right, you can go, go here, exercise, and then just right click so that it will just fit in that frame. Let's just play it now. So if you see right now, we have converted entire video into uh, mobile compatible. So there is options which we can even do more uh, onto it. Like uh, if you want some content, like uh, initially when the video starts, right, you want to cover left side and then in between it should cover in the middle. In the end, it should go, it should rotate the camera kind of stuff. So we can do that also, but I will show you that in the next video. I'll create a part two of this so that you can just dig more into the concept. For now, this is how you can just convert and then your video, normal video with just come just three steps you have to do is import the video, change the end frame for both the sides, okay, and then change the resolutions based on the compatible, and then in transform you have to change these values like position x, scale x, and scale y based on your requirement. That's all you have to uh, take care, and then it should be good. And then last step is right, what you have to do, you have to click on render and and then render animation so once you click on render anim animation set so entire video uh, it will render and give you the output of that particular video i'll pause it here and then i'll show you in the end how it looks so, so now if you can see right um, the rendering has completed so i'll go the go to output directory and this is the video so i'll play it so if you see right this is the video and the outcome of the video and anyway, you are seeing in this red because i'm playing in my computer right black left and right so when you play it in a mobile right so it will be entire fitting into your mobile screen into 9 to 16 resolution thank you all bye bye